In this video, we're going to look at using a section view in SketchUp Pro 2021. I have here a room I've used for a few demos in previous tutorials. It is a model that has a floor, walls with a door opening, and ceiling with a little bit of a trim detail in it. And the size of the room makes it challenging to set up camera views. Uh, this is a perfect scenario where a section view may come in handy to help us understand what, what is happening within this room. And I find my section under the Tools menu, Section Plane, and I click on the plane that I want to cut the section on. In this case, I'm going to click on my end wall and accept the default settings. And now if I select this section, what you'll notice is, is it is slicing and temporarily removing part of the model, which allows me to describe conditions such as how the ceiling meets the doorway, what the room looks like inside. I can look at it from any angle that I want to. This can be a very powerful tool for understanding and communicating about this, this model. If I select my section and right click, I can reverse the section if I want to, if it's going in the in the opposite direction that I would like. I could set it from being active to inactive, so I don't need to always have that cut happening. I could also align my view, which aligns with the section looking into my model. So those are all very powerful tools for managing sectional views. Let me set this not to be an active cut and add another section plane on this surface. In this case, let's move that into my scene this way. So now I have a, what I might call a longitudinal section running down the length of the room. And I have a um, shorter, maybe I'd call that a latitudinal, perhaps, who knows, section that runs this way. And I can leave these section markers in there. I could, of course, put them on their own tag and hide them and manage them that way. And they're very, very useful when I'm trying to describe to someone what exactly is happening within this 3D model. 